Okay, but let's get back to this. Uh, we already talked about Mega Lantern and Mega Roserade last time, or the first one we did. Yeah, that and that and those. But Mega Dragonite is still a possibility. Honestly, since we got Diancy, I'm still kind of hopeful that others from other uh, regions will get them. Um, yeah. But honestly, some from uh, Sinnoh actually might get one because they have a good chance. Because some were from, uh, I said because so many times. I'm just going to keep saying because until I because my because point. But some, uh, some uh, Hoenn Pokemon evolved in Sinnoh, so Gallade? Gallade I'd like to see, actually. Gallade is one that needs it. Like, he needs to either become bulkier or he needs to become very fast. I, I think... Either I or, think, either or. I think since Gardevoir got one, Gallade showed up too. Yeah, and plus Gallade got screwed with fairies, man. He used to be one, now he's now he's weak to one. Honestly, I thought they, they should have kept, like, Ralts and Curlia just pure psychic, and then just had Gardevoir psychic fairy. Why yeah, is Gardevoir but... psychic fairy to begin with? I have no idea. I I didn't understand that. I think it should have been pure psychic. And, and honestly, Mega Gardevoir should have just been psychic fairy, maybe. And he should have gained a few pounds. <laughs> uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah, because it, it, it's thin <laughs> as hell. <laughs> oh. but, but others, I... But, yeah. Uh, what would a good ability be for Gallade? Speed boost? No. Uh, well, maybe. Well, it depends, really, doesn't it? Yeah, I think. I think if you want to make it fast and hard hitting, I think. I think you maybe uh, give it like huge power. Or maybe uh, what's it called? Uh, what's that move? I mean, what's that about? Oh my. Well, he can get, like, Psycho Cut, Night Slash, and all these critical hitting moves. Super Luck? Maybe. Uh, that might be a bit overpowered. Or maybe Sniper. Sniper might work as well. I'd like to see Sniper, actually. Sniper Sniper was, uh, like, I think it was nerfed this generation since crits were nerfed. Crits used to be 200, now they're, like, 150. And then, uh, Sniper brings it back up to 200. Uh, yeah. So, uh huh. So, it's a weird thing. Speaking of Chris, reminds me of Multi Battle Monday because there are so many of them. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Yeah. I but uh, I think I think all pseudo legendaries will get Mega Evolutions, no doubt. Uh, that is where uh, that's where it gets a little weird. Raikou, Entei, and Suicune, Regirock, Registeel, uh, Regice. Regice, Moltres, Articuno, Zapdos. I'm not sure. Because they're already pretty powerful, but yet they gave no. one to Mewtwo. Well, some that's are the, not used much. That's not what I meant. I meant, like, pseudo-legendaries, like Dragonite. Oh, oh, okay, okay, okay. I get it. I get it. I understand now. Well, they gave one to a Metagross already. Uh... Think, I'm a, okay, I'm starting to accept Mega Metagross. It looks really cool, but I feel like it's like Charizard Y. They could have done more, but yet that just enough change to make it look cooler. Yeah. Honestly, I'd like I would have liked to see a little something different, but it's okay with me. I'm fine with it now. However, yeah. Mega Sableye, I'm still on the if. half and half. Yeah. Uh, okay, um... Me Mega Dragonite, I'd like to see it. Mega Dragonite, they, that'd be interesting. Keep like, multi still, raise, raise its attack, and, and its special defense. Uh, let me look at uh, Dragonite's stats real quick. It's base 600, of course, because of Studio. I see it, I see it, I see it. And, well, um, already he can get a Dragon Dance, so I don't think he needs to get any faster. He no. Might, he... It's base 80 for speed. Well, since he's like four times weak to ice, which is which is bad, like Garchomp, I'm actually yeah. surprised Garchomp's not in Ubers yet. 
that's another thing I'm surprised about because he went to Uber's like why didn't he go to Uber's? I think it was either uh, black and white or uh, or uh, uh, diamond and pearl. I don't remember which. I don't know. I just heard about that a long time ago. I never. This is the first generation I've done competitive, but like I'm surprised he did Mega Vault. Uh, no, you know what? It was black and white, I believe. But yeah, because Choice Scarf was OP. Yeah, Choice Scarf, uh, uh, Garchomp is really hard to kill. But then you got the Rocky Helmet uh, Rub Skin set, and that's pretty. It's pretty douchey. Yeah, that's, but that's back to Dragonite. Uh, just raise its attack, really. Garchomp had an attack of 170. I think that makes gives him the strongest outrage possible. Like, White Kiram has the strongest Draco Meteor. Yeah. I hate White Kiram. I hate Kiram in general. Yeah. Just, yeah. It's like Reshiram. Ding dong. <laughs> this guy knows. This guy watches my videos. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but Dragonite. Honestly, I'm surprised he's more special defensive than defensive. Like, yeah, it's, it's only by five, but special Dragonite is a thing. Special Dragonite is something that is very rarely used at all. And, and he has access to Draco Meteor, Dragon Pulse, Ice Beam. Um, uh, Hurricane and Thunder. Yeah. It is the only Pokemon that can get both Hurricane and Thunder. Okay, okay, maybe... Oh. What if you ran, like, Thunder and Hurricane and, um, its Mega Evolution got, like, Splish Flim? Oh, no. Holy shit. <laughs> uh, no, I don't know about that. <laughs> or against Drizzle. Oh, boy. <laughs> I don't see a type change going on because Dragon would have to stay because only secondary typings change. Yeah, it, if it were to change, I think I think maybe it would just get rid of the flying type. You'd make it pure Dragon. Pure Dragon, that, yeah. I, I could see that. Uh, what other Pokemon lost to type? I think it, the only one was Aggron. Oh, yeah, because it came... It was pure rock, and then it was rock steel. I mean, no, steel. It was steel rock, rock, and then it lost the rock type. And then gained filter, making it really hard... It's much harder to kill. Yeah, if you're That's training, a, it's OP. Yeah, the fence... It's got good HP, I hear myself echoing, and its defense is Shuckle. Its defense is just Shuckle. Shuckle. No, not even. You don't fuck with Shuckle. Well, Mega Aggron and Shuckle have tied special, def uh, regular defense. Shuckle still takes special defense, the highest special defense on record, I believe. Yeah. Blissey's got the highest stat ever with its HP at 255, but... Yeah, and, and uh, Florgus ties with, um, Hello and Lugia for... for Highest special defense. Is it like third, I think? Third, yes. Doesn't Mega Mewtwo have great uh, special defense? I'm pretty sure it does. I'm not sure. Oh, it's only 120. It's only 120. It, 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 it's just... Mega Mewtwo, it didn't need to happen. Honestly, I'm okay with that because I love to sweep the Elite Four with it. Yeah, so much, I know. so much fun, so much fun. But uh, something, but going a little into primal evolution, uh, Arceus is something I could see. Definitely Rayquaza. That's gonna happen. You know that. Rayquaza, no doubt. Rayquaza and me have always kind of had a love hate relationship because one, it's the mascot of Emerald, but it's the Sky Pokemon. Yeah. Me and him kind of love hate each other. Yeah. Since he and since he can be split, uh, physical or special, <laughs> split both ways. Uh, yeah. It's a pun. It was absolutely unacceptable, though. Yeah, bad puns for the win. Yeah, but uh, you know, maybe. Well, Mega, what's it called? A uh, Latias and Latias are, are already a thing, but 
Yeah. What if the Reggie's got like honestly I, I don't think they need like something, but maybe a primal uh oh, de evolution yeah. because some that like that I can see. Like their designs are really simple. So I feel like I, they can like make them complex and just put them in OU. I'd I'd actually like to see Because Primal Evolution so far is only gonna be used in Ubers because Groudon and Kyogre are already in Ubers and I don't think they'd ever go down because they're getting even more power. Yeah. And like I think um I think they both grow in huge sizes too. What? Like, n- not talk about like stats like design wise. I think primal forms are like they're, pre- they're prehistoric, man. Yeah, they're like double the size. And plus, their stats are already phenomenal. Like, looking at Kyogre, its special attack's 150, and then special defense is 140. It's got 100 yeah. HP, and then its speed is 90, which is not bad. Yeah. And so. look, looking at Groudon, he's the same, just he has better attack and defense than special defense and special attack. So they're like flip flops, and then Rayquaza is the bridge between the two. Yeah, and ba- base defense is a little worse. Base 150 for both uh, stats, and then his speed is 95, and then you got HP at 105. So Rayquaza is pretty. Black Rayquaza I like, but green could... Rayquaza is a bit. Eh. I could see um, Primal Rayquaza, Rayquaza getting a, getting a buff in both uh, attack and def- special attack. Yeah, because you can run either pretty much because he's got Outrage and he can get Dragon Pulse. He can also get Dragon Claw, I believe. And it lets fly through level up, which is actually kind of funny. That's kind of weird. Do you think you'd have to have a move tutor to get rid of it? I think so, actually. Huh. But Yeah, but I think Special Requaz is just more fun if you just want to cause some chaos. Like, maybe Dragon Pulse. I know he can learn, like, Ice Beam and Flamethrower. Can he learn Thunder? Bolt? He can learn Thunder. Oh, yeah, he can learn both. I think, he can, I, I think he can learn Dig as well. Why? Bulldoze, Earthquake. I don't see Dig here. Oh, maybe it was just in Smash Bros. I've never played Smash Bros. Ever. Well, but I know it's coming out for 3DS, so I might grab it. I don't know. Well, for a few people that do know Super Smash Bros., it, in the Subspace Emissary and Brawl, it was a boss battle with Rayquaza. And he, he, could, he could use Dig. Okay. You can also get Hyper Voice and Crunch. What? Why does he get... Okay, never mind, never mind. He gets Air Slash. He gets Sandstorm. He doesn't have any good... Physical flying moves that don't take one turn, I don't think. He can get Aerial Ace, Fly, and a Sky Drop. Yeah. I'm surprised he doesn't get Acrobatics. That'd be pretty neat, actually, but... But oh well. But I've never played Ubers because I don't got enough good Uber Pokemon to play. That Blaziken and Lucario I have is it, but I use them in double. Yeah. Um, right. Let's go back to Mega Evolutions because I bet this is probably already twenty, almost twenty minutes long, maybe half hour. Don't know. Don't really care. I'll worry about it when we're done. Yeah. So Salamence, Salamence, and Flygon. Yeah, I, I, that's. It's kind of happening. I'd like to see Flygon more sal more than Salamence. But... I, why do we have two pseudo legendaries in this generation? Actually, I'm not sure, but it's weird. Metagross and you got Salamence. This, I think, this is the only region we've gotten two, right? Yeah, we've always gotten at least one because we have Gudra now. Yeah, I'm, Gudra. I, I was surprised Noivern was in a pseudo legendary, but that's okay because usually pseudo legendaries can run both physical and special. Just one is better than the other. That's usually the case, like with, uh, oh, what's it called, uh, I'm thinking of words, don't help me. Do, 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 no Jeopardy music! Do. Um, I think Salamence, I think it was Salamence. Salamence can no, run, 
It's Salamence and Gudra. That was the one I was thinking of, Gudra. Yeah. All right, but honestly, I would love to see Mega Flygon. Joey really wants Mega Flygon, but however, uh, if it were to get a type change, it'd keep ground. Ugh. Honestly, ground flying is an option. I'd rather keep this dragon type. I, I, I'd rather keep it still dragon flying, to be honest. Yeah, I, because I, if it was to go bug type... Like, like some people want, uh, ground bug. It would, it would. Eh, it's a little bit on the iffy side. It's like an Inkata. Yeah, I'd like, I'd like to see, uh, I'd like to see Bug Dragon on uh, Mega Yen Mega. Yes. Wait, is Yen Mega bug or flying first? I think it's bug. Yeah, it's bug first. So, Bug Dragon, I would love Yamega to get a Mega Evolution, but Yama is originally from uh, Johto. You know, Johto is still an option since, like I said earlier, uh, you get the Johto starter at the end. Because Johto's always just kind of been there with Kanto and Hoenn, I feel yeah, like. I think jo there's like a lot of Johto Pokemon that are like went into Hoenn too, like Skarmory, Cargo. Yeah. Uh, Honestly, Skarmory does not need a Mega. That thing is already bulky as hell. Yeah. But I'm going to actually look at the Alpha Sapphire Pokedex I got here, because some, like, I mean, regular, Sap the original Sapphire Pokedex, because you know how they'll integrate some uh, other Pokemon from other gens? Yeah. So I think... If I look here, like, uh, you see a lot of Pokemon here, like, from other generations, like, uh, Sea King, Gyarados... Azumarill. Why yeah. did we get? Why did we get a pre-evolution in uh in Hoenn when Meryl was in Johto? I don't. I still don't understand why they gave a zero one. Well, I, honestly, it's kind of like how Ro Rosalia was. It gained a baby Pokemon and an, and an evol evolution. Rosalia's a boss. Rosalia is just a boss. Then we got Golem in here as well. Crobat. So, yeah, we got a lot of Pokemon from uh, Kanto and uh, Sinnoh. I mean, my god, that game was not invented yet. Kanto and Johto. I think more Johto Pokemon appeared than Kanto. So. Johto, there's not many good options to go with. Because good ones like Ampharos and Scizor have already got Megas. Lantern's still an option. You know? Yeah, Lantern, Yamega is one... Uh, yeah, Yamega is one I could see. I, I thought I said Yama. Uh, yeah. Honchkrow. Honchkrow and Miss, and Miss Magius. That, that, I'd like to see Miss Magius, honestly. Because... Honestly, Miss Mag... I've actually seen Evolite Mistrevis, and that thing is actually a pretty good boss. It's like a tank. Yeah. I'd, I'd like to see... Um... Miss Magius game, game evolution. The only person yeah. I've seen use Miss Ma use Miss Magius correctly, well, use Miss Magius at all, is my friend from Hershey. Ah, I like. And, I've always wanted to train a Miss Magius, but I'm still trying to figure out a good team to have it on. Right now, I'm making another doubles team, and man, is it destructive. I'm. I might. I might um train up a um mischievous one day. Yeah, then Honchkrow. Honchkrow is another one. He's known as the Big Boss Pokemon. So... And his it, shiny form is pink, making him manlier. Yes. <laughs> but... You can get Honchkrow, super luck, man. You can get super Hon luck. Yeah, Honchkrow by itself is pretty cool. It's pretty powerful itself. If you However, use it. its defenses blow. Yeah, maybe if... And its big... speed is not something to be bragging about. No. And, but its HP is at 100, so if you train it in a, a, attack and HP, you might be able to live to see the next round, maybe put it on a Trick Room team. Yeah. You don't know. It could be a thing. I've seen people use uh, Honchkrow before. I'm okay. I've seen people, preferably Martin, use uh, Prankster Murkrow. That's OP. Frick. Yes, it is, because it gets Feather Dance. 
it get it's banned from LC, believe it or not. Little Cup, yeah, and it also get it also has Quash, so it's a perfect candidate in doubles. Yeah, and um, there's like a little there's like Uber's Little Cup, I believe. Yeah. I'm like tiny Uber. <laughs> little Cup is something I just never cared for at all. But let's go back to Hoenn. Those were naming a lot of things from Johto. Milotic is a good, uh... Milotic, yeah. yes. Like, yeah. why did... First of all, I'm, I'm curious. Why did Gyarados go Water Dark instead of Water Dragon? I don't know. I don't get that, first of all. Second, so, second of all, uh, to counter it, uh, Water Fairy for Milotic. Like, a yeah. lot of people are thinking Milotic would go Water Fairy... But it doesn't get any fairy moves, I don't think. Move Tutor is an option. Move Tutors is an option. Option. I'm looking for it right now in the Pokedex. Teach my logic Moon Blast and... Dazzling Gleam. Play rough. Oh yeah, it does have access to get Dazzling Gleam, so... Oh, it does? Dude, it yeah. doesn't got access to Dazzling Gleam. Oh, it doesn't? I, you mentioned Dazzling Gleam. I thought you were, like, talking about, like, Milotic can learn it. Oops. No, I, it can't. But I like it. Milotic's abilities are pretty good. Marvel scale and, uh, what's it called? Uh, competitive. Yeah. Competitive is, like, the defiant, which is the opposite. Special attack raise when a stat is dropped. I, I could see, um... I, yeah, I can see Mega Milotic becoming, like, Water Fairy, and then, like, getting access to Moonblast and Dazzling Gleam through Move Tutor. Most likely. And, um... Dazzling Gleam's most likely gonna be another TM, I hope. Maybe. I've always thought the TM system would be weird, but... Mega Soul Rock and Lunatone is an option, but... Soul Rock and Lunatone is... So I want them to do something with them. Because look at, all that, no, sh look at all this untapped potential. It's, they're meteorite Pokemon. They're owned by the double battle trainers. Uh, Tate and Liza. Tate and Liza. And that's the gym leaders. Well, wouldn't it make sense to have, like, some gyms have, maybe that'd be a great time to get Mega Pokemon, maybe? Because Mega that's Solrock and Lunatone, they have to do something with them extraordinary. They gotta take them out of the depths of which they were created and just turn into the most badass things ever. They're like, like they're like meteorite in faces like Glalie is, but this is kinda weird how I would think about it. Like honestly I thought they could like maybe And this is may still be an option, like Evolve or uh Mega or Primal, like Fuse. Uh, or Fusion's an option. Fusion, I'm not sure about, because the only thing that happens is with Kiram, and Kiram sucks, but... But I've always it, thought Lunatone to, like, evolve into, like, some kind of moon, uh, Sphinx, and then Soul Rock into some kind of Sun Griffin. I don't know honestly, why. That'd be awesome. Honestly, yeah, that would be, but I always... I always thought of, um... Uh, what was I thinking? I was thinking, um... I'm, I'm going to make a Zelda reference here. Um, like the Majora's Mask Moon, I always thought of Lunatone and, and Soul Rock. I always thought of like the um, Soul Eater, the the Sun from Soul uh, Eater. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I know what you're talking about. Or the Moon from Soul Eater with Lunatone. Yeah, but. yeah. But those two, I would never suspect for a Mega. I would be shocked if they gave them one. Yeah. Because Rock Psychic is kind of a bad combo. Yeah, it's weak to, um... Six different... Th one, two, three, four, five, six... Yeah, six. No, seven, just... seven, 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 seven. Doesn't it resist bug, actually? It doesn't res... No, uh, gr rock does not resist bug. You're thinking of ground. Oh, yeah. Uh, I think bug is neutral. Yeah, so I'd, I'd like to see them, like, do something with it. Honestly. They either gotta make him like the ultimate face gods, or or like you you mentioned, like the phoenix and the sphinx. Uh, Griffin, Griffin, Griffin sphinx. My bad. 
Phoenix Pokemon would be cool, but I don't think we got one other than Ho Ho, and I want one that's just playing on fire. I want it to be a chocolate type. I want Ho Ho to be a chocolate type. Oh, I get it. It's a it's a snack. <laughs> it's a snack. Definitely snack. Zangoose and Saviper is another one I can see. To be honest. Yeah, but you you if if you watch videos in the past, fans, you you've seen my Zangus. It's blue, and, and I hate you. <laughs> <laughs> and then, then Saviper's just a dick. The big bat. <laughs> like everybody knows my hatred of snakes probably by now, and I, you can see why I hate Saviper. Snake. Yep, and that's why Zangoose is one of my favorites, because he's a mongoose. And what do mongooses hate? Snakes! Snakes. Exactly. So Zangoose, Altaria is another option. Dragon Fairy, I keep saying. Mega yes. Sarah, Dragon Fairy, Moonblast, it has access to Moonblast, just make, make it Dragon Fairy, and the day there. Yeah, and then it also has Cotton Guard, and its special defense is already pretty good. So yeah. it can be like a tank from the sky. The sky gods. I'd, I'd like to see that, actually. What about Cacturn? Mm, that's actually pretty interesting. Cacturn has so much untapped potential. His stats absolutely suck because his attack and special attack are entirely split at 115. Yeah. And his defense, his speed, his HP, his HP is okay, but the other stats kind of really suck. Yeah. yeah, Sand Veil and Water Absorb. Give him, like, Speed Boost or something, or Rough Skin. Yeah, give him Rough, rough Skin would make him better, I think. I would Ugh. make, well, I don't know. They gotta make him either faster or bulky. I'd, like, I'd rather see him bulky. Cacturn yeah. gets an A-plus on design. I like, I like, it's the only good cactus Pokemon we got, because we got Merrick Cactus. That don't look no good. Honestly, we don't have any Gen 5 Megas. We don't, and that, we should, okay, we'll get into that, but, I think, but let's talk about Camerupt and Sharpedo first. Then we'll go to uh, Gen 5. I, I think I, I think I see that more uh, obvious. It's either that, or... Both of Maxi and what was the other guy? Archie. Maxi and Archie. You see how much I remember from Gen 3, but. Yes. Uh, but they're either going to have their respected Sharpedo and Camera up, or they're both going to have Mega Mighty Anna. Which, Mega Mighty Anna is something I want, but I don't want. I want Sharpedo and Camera up to get it. However, Sharpedo is, is a bit tricky. Because I'd... he's already going to have speed boost. Would it go to OU? It, it would definitely be an OU, because first you get that one speed boost off, then Mega Evolve. And then bam. Yes. What do I have then? Um, tough, rough rough head? I mean, uh, strong Jaws. Strong Jaw, yeah. That would be absolutely perfect. He can, it... get, he can get Ice Fang, that's it. And Crunch. Yeah, I sang a Crunch, but still, those two moves would be better. And it has access to Aqua Jet, too. It doesn't, well, it's really fast already, Matt. And plus, uh, what's a 95 stat exactly? It's about, hold on, it's about like 155, and if I put this through a calculator, times like 1.5, it's already going to have 232 speed if it's still has base 95. Yeah. So that's gonna be. So Sharpedo, I would definitely see an OU, but going to Camerupt, Camerupt is not used very much at all. I don't believe. I don't think he's used at all. I never seen him. Ever. Uh, he has Anger Point, which actually kind of scares me. What does Anger Point do again? It it maximizes your attack on taking a crit. Oh. And. Okay, he would be perfect on Trick Room. His his attack and special attack are split, but his attack's like off by five to special attack, and his defense and HP are all at seventy. 
So, honestly, I think they gotta nerf one of the attack stats a lot, and then just put them both in defense and raise his special attack up a bit. Or one of his attack stats. Honestly... I'd like to see a more special, honestly. Oh, holy shit, he can, uh, he can get flame charge. Oof. Uh, oh, that's a kick in the balls. And actually, th- well, when we do these, I think of so many great ideas to do. Yes. He can also get stockpile. Oh, 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 I just came up with the best strategy, but I won't say. Not to mention Iron Head as well. Like, yeah, I know it's a stockpile strategy, Matt, but what's 70 no. base stat? It's like 135 max. I believe, I don't know, I'm just thinking out loud. Uh, yeah. 135, let me think here, 135 times, and say, the max stockpile is 3, so that's about 2.5. Okay, yeah. calculator, work with me. That brings you up to 337 uh, defense stats. Wow. So, that's yeah. So, honestly, see, Pokemon like this have hidden potential. They just gotta find it. And honestly, you can run him physical or special because of this split stat, but he's not that great at taking hits. So, yeah. Maybe, well, you probably could run Assault Vest. Assault yeah. Vest mixed is maybe is an option, but he can get, like, great stuff like Earthquake, Earth Power, uh, Lava Plume, and Eruption, and the, can he get... I don't think he can get flame, uh, Flare Blitz. Can he... He can't get Flare Blitz. He can? He can't. Oh. So, I think he'd be better special, but physical is an option. And he can't get burned because he's a fire type. Yeah. But the only physical fire move he can get is, uh... Is, uh, Flame Charge. That's that could... That's that it. could actually be, um... Well, when you, you count it, when you count a an 100 attack stat with stab and stuff, it's it's still going to do quite a bit of damage. And can he get sword stance? He can't. No. Nope. No sword stance for you. Nope, but he can get swagger. <laughs> oh, that was bad. Oh, yep, thanks, Klecky. Yep, thanks. He can also get Explosion, I think. I just saw. Um, I wouldn't use that. No, he can't. Never mind. It was Endure. I don't know where my eyeballs are. I think they were. <laughs> Never mind. Um... <laughs> yeah, you better keep your mouth shut. I, I, I'm just gonna... I... Honestly, like, Fire Ground, it's an okay... Uh, it's, it's one of those it's like ground flying you got that four times weakness and then you got the one just two time weakness like Malamar's typing, Gliscor's typing, Camerup's typing there was, I think there was another one wasn't there another fire ground type other than uh, Primal Groudon, I don't know I don't think, I think he was the only fire ground let me look I think, yeah, I think we'll only camera with the problem we're out on now. I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking. I think that's wrong. Yeah, but it's only them. Uh. I thought, I thought another one, but oh well. I was thinking of my cargo, but he's fire rock. Yeah, fire rock. Ground is better than rock with, uh, re- resistance wise, because rock's got more weaknesses. Yeah. Uh, okay, but I think. I think we covered pretty much the majority of Pokemon yeah. that can Mega Evolve from Hoenn. Unless you want to see Mega Slack King and just give him huge power for the hell of it. Oh, <laughs> oh it's, no, thank you. It's the ban. Instant ban from Ubers. <laughs> it's a ban from the metagame. It just. It's, no. Dude, it's in you, you. So Which is going? scary. <laughs> if you get if you set him up in a double choice scarf with Giga with uh, Giga Impact, you're pretty much set for life. <laughs> you can even run a scarf uh, 
uh, Giga Impact for singles, if you wanted to. I saw a Pimp Knight do it once. God, Slay King with huge... <laughs> uh, <laughs> that'd be broken. It's a, his attack stat's already 160. And then just give, all, give like, a, make it, make it a base 260. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> Give me your power. And it, and his HP and defense stats are also pretty good. His special attack's even not bad. Why don't we just give him like an ultra mega evolution and and raise all its stats by like two fifty? Uh, no, that, oh. that, I don't like it. That would be a more powerful thing of you to why. Uh, no, th- yeah, I'm done. No more comprehendo, man. Uh, but, okay. But before we go to Unova, I want Pokemon from this generation that do not need a Mega. Burloom, he doesn't need one. He's already good enough. And Boom. then, and then Crawdont. Crawdont, Crawdont has Dragon Dance. And yeah. it has adaptability. Adaptability, yes. And, and Crab Hammer is OP. And Crab Hammer. And you can probably... Most people are on Focus Sash, but if you wanted to, you could run, uh, what's it called? Uh, Scope Lens. Yeah, or Torque Band, too. Crawdon, hands down, does not ever need a Mega. No. It... I have almost gotten swept by them. If you look back deep into the bowels of the Captain Zector channel, you may find that video. There's, um... It was before the Captain's Challenge was made. I think I just called them X and Y Wi-Fi battles. Yeah, and Cradilly I could see, actually. Cradilly and, uh... Armaldo. Armaldo, that was what I was thinking of. I think Cradilly more, because, I mean, no, come they on. Would, they would not just give one, they would have to give both. Yeah. But... But I'd like to see Cradilly more, to be honest, because Cradilly just... I mean, come on, how many more dicks does it need? <laughs> I don't know, but it, just make just give him more sticks. Uh, make... <laughs> why, Matt? Just Matt, go to hell. <laughs> uh, Dookie Shed for the win. Uh, Dookie Shed for the win. Oh, uh, what were we talking about again? I just forgot. Okay. Um, I forgot. Before I reference Cordelia's. <laughs> 